What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video with Scooter by 666. Today, we are looking back at Phantom Chasers. We got another update with some new events. We're going to take a look at that and see if it's worth returning to this game yet or not. Winner takes all. Let's see what that is. Winner takes all. January 11th through the 18th. Daily challenge, clear stage three, clear stage three times, 100,000 gold, clear stage five times, summon ticket, 10 times, star stone, every day. Yeah, mm -hmm. better than none, I guess. Okay, okay. Stupid phone, stop it. Okay, hammer time. Let's see what hammer time is. 11th through the 18th. 50% uh, off for creating things in the lab. Me, I guess, whatever. It wasn't really that expensive in the first place, I thought. Uh, create a gear level 1, get 100,000 gold, gear level 3. Starstone, gear level 5, 3,000 gold, or 300,000 gold, gear level 10, Starstone times 3. Okay. Is this a once? Yeah, once per account. Eh, I guess, whatever. Secret agent, what did he, I'm pretty sure that's the same guy as before. I didn't even bother to get him last time. Pretty sure. Okay, so this is the event right here. This is the one that might make it worth it to come back to this game right here. Um, January 11th through February 8th. So you got... Was that three weeks? Something like that? Three or four weeks? Every... 1,000 stamina, they give you 100 stamina, up to 42 times. Every 3,000 stamina, they give you 100,000 gold, up to 14 times. Every 5,000 stamina spent, they give you 2 star stones, up to 8 times, so up to 16 star stones. Okay, that's not so bad. Because, I mean, you gotta grind for like 20 billion hours a day to get anywhere in this game anyway, so you're gonna be doing lots of grinding anyway, so I might as well give you stuff for it, right? But here's where it gets interesting, okay? 2,638, and boy, these are weird numbers. Uh, stamina spent total, they give you a summon ticket, 2 to 4, then at 5,275, they get a 3 to 4, and then at 10,000. 549, they give you a 4 to 5 summon ticket. But wait, there's more. Because at 21,098, they give you a for sure 5 star summon ticket. A for sure 5 star summon ticket. And then, if you can double that, or more than double that, 42,195, they give you a 5 star shaman of transcendence. You know, which is handy, you know, even though you need 10 of them to get a five star up to level 500, 10 of them, but they're going to give you one at least. Ridiculous. So, I mean, okay, they're basically, if you do all of this grinding, they're basically giving you a for sure level 140 monster. A 5 star level 140 monster. Or, you know, depending on what you get, you could get a skill up for a level 5 star you already have. Plus, they give you a shaman of transcendence if you get that far. It's an automatic skill up for any 5 star you have. It's not a negative thing. I mean, you're going to be grinding like crazy to do that anyway, so... But, I don't see any drop rate improvements or anything like that. And drop rates are terrible in this game, as far as I'm concerned. So they still need to fix that. And the events they put in are good for earning star stones. 
But man, I'm telling you. Seriously. The other thing here. So clear normal or hard three times. Stage three. And... All these other things here. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know. The, the bur uh, burning salmon event is probably the best event I've seen so far. They need definitely need to do more stuff like that. But I just, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I still, I, I, I was having a lot more fun with, um, on, uh, on my OG, on, on my OG, whatever, however you say it, uh, than I am with this game, or than I ever was with this game. And this game was fun towards the beginning, but it just became really apparent that the costs were too high and the grinding requirements were too high. So, I don't know, it's up to you guys. If you really enjoy this game, go ahead and keep playing it, but, uh, and definitely take advantage of that event because it's a good event, but, uh, my recommendation, if you like gotcha games, on my OG is a much better game than this one. Alright, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe button, leave me a comment, let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know what you like, what's your favorite gotcha game. Uh, what's your favorite Android game? Definitely let me know. Take it easy guys, have a good one.